Hey guys, it's Skulk3 and welcome to part 7 of Let's Play Arn's Winter Quest. In the last part, we defeated the Starman Senior, and in this part, our teddy bear is gone, because I had to go back through the last area again because I forgot to save. Here's a goat thing. Let's kill him. Die, goat thing. Wow, Arn took a pretty heavy beating in that fight. Um, Well, seeing as there's a magic butterfly right over there, we'll just completely heal him and... Get back here, you! I need to eat you or something. How exactly do you make them relax? I don't know, man. Maybe it's just because they're so pretty. Or something. Ah! Starman! I have to say, I do quite like Starman Funk. He's pretty cool. Um, I'm quite not quite sure exactly how you miss with a guitar solo, but... Whoa. Leave me alone, Christmas bats or something. So apparently when flying rats die, they actually turn to ice instead of fire. Um, or they catch on ice. Yeah, because that makes sense. Um, let's go down here and read this here sign. The sign clearly says 9. Actually, it literally says 8. That's only if you squint. I can't say I see either of them, but... Did that waffle just appear from nowhere? I don't really want to fight- Ah! Wow, that's a fast waffle! Jeez! I really hate great waffles. I didn't even beat him, I just had to run away! He, like, killed everyone! <laughs> it was a massacre! Anyways, um... It's a good thing that these benches make you come back to life as well. That's I, I do appreciate that. Um, but I never want to fight a Great Waffle again. <laughs> um, they are way too strong, and they can... It was especially unhelpful that Arn started acting unusual just before he used PSI Ice Gamma. And so, you know, he kind of killed Ness. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was not fun. Um, this sign obviously says three. If you look closely though, you can see an ob an un bleh. you can see an unobvious four written in dust. Not that it matters anyway. What is it with numbers? Uh, okay, there's a dinosaur. How are you doing, dinosaur man? There's some birds in a an apparent sort of cage thing. Uh, hi hi birds in a sort of makeshift cage. Uh, let's go and look inside this present, which contains uh, Arthur cuffs. Um, what? Do you equip those, dog? You can. Um, who has the lowest defense? Not including Sherm, because that doesn't help. Okay, I think Arn needs those. So, goodbye, snake armband. And hello, Arthur Cups. I really don't get what the Arthur Cups are referenced to, if anything, but I'll accept them. Uh, let's head on over to our previous administration, or whatever that means. I really have no idea. Uh, here's another present! Dynamite! Hooray! Everyone loves dynamite. Um, and now I'm really lost again. Everyone loves mazes, don't they, in games? Yeah, they're absolutely hilarious. Except sometimes they're not. Uh, this isn't like a terrible maze or anything, but just, you know, it's convoluted and... Waffle! 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 Do you like waffles? No! Fuck off! I hate them! I think anyone who's played this will now have an irrational hatred for waffles. Magic soap, that's better than cold remedy, because that's essentially... Is that like cure alpha, I think? Um, so let's open the present and get magic soap, which can do anything! Go magic soap! Ting! Well, that was meant to be sort of flash off the smile in all the cartoons and such. Uh, there's more Starman Funks. I, I like them. Hey, back attack! That's helpful. Starman Funk is still awesome. One of his attacks is a high five. I, I really like that. Just, that guy is cool. Um, let's heal Sherm up as well. And head on our merry way. To nothing. Actually, that might lead to somewhere, but I want to get that present. There's... <sighs> Starman Funk. Okay, he's just made Sherm feel mature. <laughs> Um, <laughs> mushroomization! Oh god, that is awesome! Look at that hat! Um, can you get rid of that? I don't know! Um, I, I don't want to fight anyone while I'm still feeling mature. <laughs> I think, um, okay, if I can remember what the attack was, it was, uh, he did something, the uh, Starman Funk did something that was so incredibly awesome that you realize you'd never be able to match his skill. And then he felt mature. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'll stop laughing about this soon, but that is just awesome. Um, 
yeah, I I'll cut back. I'll cut out. I'll cut out the walk back up to that area just because you know you probably don't want to see it. Um, but you get to see the weird floating top hat, and let's hope this gets rid of it. Because if it doesn't, then I am. Hooray! There he goes. Right. I'll meet you back up there. Okay. I'm pretty sure in that fight the um the Starman Funk did. Oh, there's another molten gold. Uh. I think the Salmon Funk did something, it was like he gave us a thumbs up and a cool smile and our guts raised loads. It was really weird. Um, not sure why he has that attack, but whatever. Why do I still have that? <laughs> um, molten Gold, yay. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how it's going to heal us, because if we eat it, that surely sounds like it would be painful. And undigestible. So it would be painful in many other respects! Oh, this is not a back attack. Wonder how long it's gonna be before I get tired of the fights with the Starman Funks. Starman Funk became framed and was ultimately arrested for criminal charges that were not its fault. Ah, oh, poor Starman Funk. Damn you, Starman Funk! And now Ness is feeling mature. Oh, and the hat's actually—he's wearing a hat on a hat. Uh, Sherm just learned a move called Dark Storm Alpha, so that's gonna be pretty cool to see. Uh, and I didn't realize just how low dog, how low our health were. Um, our health were, our health was. Um, yeah. Uh, once again, I'm gonna go quickly back and heal. Civilized. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really like the status effect. Uh, BRB. You know, I'm not tired of the actual battles. I'm just tired that they they're occurring so often. Go away. Ah. How's that a back attack? Fobbies are orange. They are indeed. Uh, keep going onwards. Oh, yeah, you. Oh, go away, Fobby! I don't get why that wasn't an auto kill. We killed him and he didn't even get a move. I don't know. I opened the present and there was a photo of NLA inside. I want to know what that does. Uh, we shall get rid of an awesome sauce. Because we don't even eat the food. <laughs> uh, there's a photo of NLA. Let's see what it does. Help! A face only your mom could love, as NLA's parents disowned him long ago for being so ugly. When used during battle, it paralyzes all foes and then burns up in a very unholy ritual. When used outside of battle, your character looks at it and paralyzes themselves with ugliness. Well, that's what you get for carrying it around in your wallet. Right. I have no idea who or what NLA is, but I don't want to see him or her or it or them or such. Um. Oh. Go away, Great Waffle! Over here! Over here! Hey, hey, hey! Over here! Oh, I was hoping we could trick him. Fine, I'll try and despawn you, because I... Ah! Starman Funk! <laughs> Again! I'm leveling up like mad in this area, seriously. Starman Funks give you loads of experience, it's awesome. Um, and the battles are really fun, uh, just because the attacks are so awesome. Uh, I'm still thinking that, yes, don't worry, I haven't got tired of them yet. Go away, blood thing. Apparently the blood dove doesn't actually have anything to do with blood. According to his entrance, uh, his entrance text. So I don't know, man. Maybe he just likes the name. Okay, there was a healing thing up here the whole time. I could probably have used that. I don't know. Um, now I don't know exactly how long this video is, but uh, basically I've been recording for about 25 minutes. Uh, so since the next area looks quite important, I'm going to end this part here. Uh, thanks for watching this part, which was just me going through a cave filled with enemies uh, and grinding pointlessly. Uh, but yeah, uh, you can see how to get through the cave, you can see items that are there, uh, you know how awesome Starman Funk is. Uh, I will see you in the next part, guys. Goodbye!